there's something wrong with my camera. Hello, my name is Liz Ashley and welcome to my channel. I've recorded this like three times now and every time something has been wrong. We are going to be talking about Olivia Rodrigo versus Donald Trump, okay? Ew. I hate Donald Trump. I love Olivia Rodrigo. Olivia Rodrigo is amazing. I love her. She's one of my favorite artists. I listen to her all the time. Um, and I just love her angst. Like, I love how angsty she is. She also was a Hasnavi head at one point and, you know, fellow Hasnavi head here. So, Trump has a tendency of using musicians' music without their permission. Trump uh, always uses people's stuff and people are always like, do not use my music. Like, I do not condone this, right? And something that he did the other day was actually use one of Olivia Rodrigo's for one of his TikTok videos. And she like commented here, I'll put the comment up, but she commented and she was like, ew, no, like I do not want you to use my music. Like do not use my music. And then in like the best move, a queen move, I love her so much. She just took the whole entire song off TikTok. She was like, no, you no, no one can use it now. No, thank you. I'm not going to be associated with you or your TikTok. And I love that and I support her and I think that's great and I love it yeah <laughs> I love it so much Olivia Rodrigo is amazing and I love her and um yeah if you guessed it that's not all we're talking about today I'm also gonna talk about I guess my views on the election results like I said I hate Trump um so obviously I did not vote for him I voted for Kamala Harris and um you know I'm a leftist I'm a Hasanavi head so like I voted for her and you know, I was excited. I was excited when they picked Tim Walls. I was not excited about how right wing the campaign was. I was a little apathetic during this, uh, <laughs> during this time. And I feel a little bit guilty for that now. I'm worried about a lot of the people in my community. I'm worried about some of my friends. I think something that I want to do is get back into my community because I was very much in my in my community uh during the midterms last time and I canvassed and I text banked and I phone banked and um you know I went to different community events and there are a lot of good organizations out there that, like in Missouri we just voted for abortion rights and so I do think that there are some wins and that there are some reasons to like keep going. I think the next four years is going to be really difficult. I think it's important for people to to learn about different different movements and my two cents on it. You know, I definitely am going to get back in my community and start getting more involved in organizations and stuff. And I still have a lot of friends in those in those organizations and um, in this community. But I thought this was important to talk about and I wanted to talk about it. So let me know how you feel below. Let me know what you think below. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.